Software Spring Presence How to use SYD in Google Sheets Hi folks! Greetings! Welcome to the tutorial on the SYD function. Here's an introduction to SYD. SYD stands for sum of years digits depreciation, and is the method this function uses to calculate the depreciation of an asset. Ok, let's look at the sum of years depreciation formula. Here's an example. Cost of asset is rupees 50,000. Salvage value is rupees 12,500. Life of asset is 12 years. Sum of years is 78. Let's plug the data into the formula, and get the depreciation amount, at the end of year 1. This is the depreciation amount. Alright, let's look at the format of the SYD function. Here's an example. Cost is the cost of the asset. Salvage is the value of the asset, at the end of the last year of its useful life. Life is the number of periods, over which the asset depreciates. Period is a sub-period, within the number of periods, for which you want to calculate the depreciation. Moving forward, here is an objective for using the SYD function. To calculate the depreciation amount of a computer, whose cost is rupees 100,000, salvage value rupees 9,000, and useful life 7 years. Alright, let me type the data. Ok, let's type the SYD function formula in this cell. First, type equal to, S, Y. Select SYD from the menu. For cost, click this cell. Type comma. For salvage, click this cell. Type comma. For life. Click this cell. Type comma. And, lastly, for period, click this cell. Press enter. There you go. The SYD function has returned the depreciation amount at the end of year 1. Alright, the next step is to copy this formula down these cells. Before we do that, we have to lock the addresses in this formula. By doing so, the addresses will not change, as we copy the formula down the cells. Click this cell. Select these addresses. We will not lock the year cell address, as we want the year to change. Press F4. Press Enter. OK, let's copy the formula. Moving forward, we will now calculate the depreciation using the formula. Let's recall the formula again. First, let's sum the years, using the sum formula. Soon, we will be using this data in the formula. Next, let's copy the year data, and paste it here. Sort the data in the descending order. Why sort? Because to calculate the first year depreciation, we should use the life of the asset value, which is 7. Similarly, to calculate the second year depreciation, we should reduce the useful life to 6, and so on. Ok, we are now set to type the sum of years depreciation formula in this cell. Type equal to, and the opening parenthesis. For year, click this cell, and type the division operator. For sum of years, click this cell, and type the closing parenthesis. Type the multiplication operator, and the opening parenthesis. 
subtract the salvage value from cost, and type the closing parenthesis. Press Enter. Alright, here is the depreciation amount at the end of year 1, which is the same as calculated by the SYD function. Before we copy the formula down these cells, we have to lock the addresses of these cells in the formula, so, let me go ahead and lock them. Now, let's copy the formula. Lastly, let's calculate the value of the computer, taking depreciation into account. Type the cost of the asset here, by typing equal to, and clicking this cell, and press enter. Subtract this amount, from this amount. Copy the formula. There you go. This is the value of the computer, at the end of the year of its useful life. To remove the dollar symbol, select these ranges. Click this down arrow. Select number. That's it folks. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel.